As Fresno County continues to accelerate its reopening process, the health department is ramping up their contact tracing team. That team includes school nurses and training begins this week. Our Angelica Leilani joins us live from Fresno State where those classes will be held. Angelica. Well, because in-person classes are not happening right now here at Fresno State, the college is simply being used for its large classrooms. Now, the health department says these new sessions come as the state implemented a new program to help with contact tracing. In Fresno County, the health department says about half of the COVID-19 cases are close contact related. This week, they're increasing their contact tracing team after the state implemented a new program. From what I've heard of it, it's going to be a lot more uh, collaborative. So we're going to be able to work with our partners outside of the county to help us do this contact tracing as far as, uh, you know, congregate settings, places that uh, see a lot of people um, and people that have that capacity to help us out and do this. Michael Flores, co-lead for the contact tracing team for the Fresno County Health Department, says one of the big collaborations will be with school districts. We're going to be hiring some of the school nurses uh, to be trained on a lot of this stuff so that when school does start happening, uh, they'll be able to take that to each of their, uh, you know, respective districts and uh, help us do this contact tracing if, if there is a case in any of their areas. The sessions will be held at Fresno State and will be a two day training. The health department says right now they have about 110 people on their contact tracing team. The new class will bring them up to about 130, but they plan on including more down the line. We're hoping that our community based organizations will be able to help us out with this. Uh, you know, faith-based organizations, just places where there's a lot of people around. And the Fresno County Public Health Department says that they are still working with Fresno State using their lab to help process COVID-19 tests. Reporting live in Fresno, I'm Angelica Leilani, KC24 Local News That Matters.